Yo, Cape okay, It's Guy Hoops going on YouTube. So, you saw at the top of this video, I'm downgrading from 7.2.4 to 5.2.4. And let me tell you why. Um, my first reason, obviously, is just my room is just too small for it. I always get a, a lot of comments about how big those speakers are behind my head. Usually the comments are, those things must be so loud, how do you even hear? Da, da, da. They are equally um, as loud as everything else in the room. They're obviously um, calibrated to fit the space, of course. Um, but I decided to change it because I feel like I wasn't getting any benefits out of it um, the way that I normally would because they are so close. Um, also, when I had my surround um, left and right on the sides, they were kind of more in front of us than my couch was. Uh, they weren't directly to my side like they're supposed to be. And so I really wasn't getting a lot of um, side effects like I would if I kind of had it in a proper place. So I decided to go ahead and take the big speakers off the back of the wall and then put the bookshelves just to the side of the couch like you would in a 5.1 or a 5.1.2, whatever you have going on. I decided to do that. So I'm going to recalibrate the system. I'm not in this video, just in general time. I'm going to recalibrate that. I think I'm going to like it much more. Also, I have a spoiler alert that nobody knows about. I'm going to go ahead and tell you this. I just ordered some SVS Prime Elevation speakers for the Atmos. Just two of them, not four. I went ahead, I'm going to go change. You guys already know that I have some old Harmony Carden satellite speakers hanging from the ceiling now. We're going to go get those replaced with some proper Atmos speakers. And everybody knows Prime Elevations from SVS. They're, um, they're regarded as one of like the best elevation speakers that you can get. So I'm going to go ahead and put those in and get these off the ceiling. Um, should be a nice cleaner look and a much better sound. That's what I'm excited for. Also, now that I've taken off um, two of my speakers off the Model 7, I'm going to be running the elevations on the Model 7. So I'm going to be getting good power for the elevations. And then I'm going to actually move these bookshelf speakers, the side surround or the back surrounds that I had in here, I'm going to bring them to the, um, the new listening room. And they're going to be my rear speakers for a while as I start to get that room set up and get new speakers in there and things like that. So I told you guys I was getting a second listening room. So those aren't going anywhere. Don't think that I'm gonna give them away because it's not happening. Eventually I'll move out of this apartment and get a bigger space so these will be back in the equation eventually. But for now we're gonna use them as just a two channel listening room um, and then we're gonna power those with the Emotiva Base XA300 that I've had in the past. A two channel amplifier, we're gonna use it in the bedroom there. So that's that'll be really cool. Also, I told you guys that I was gonna go ahead and um, announce the winner of the giveaway on Monday, but of course I already know who the winner is. I got my first comment. So um, it's kind of mixed up. Devin, he was gonna be the first winner of it, but when I went to my scribe subscribers list, you weren't on there. So I can't say that you're a subscriber or not. I know that you have to have it in the settings to where people can or cannot see you, um, who you're subscribed to. I don't know if your settings are not correct or not, um, but you got the first comment, but you're, I can't see you on my subscribers list. So I just have to say that you're not a subscriber. But if you are, I apologize, let me know. And I do have a special gift for you otherwise. Um, but my soundbar winner, which is over here in the corner, I'll show you guys back over there. I put it all nice and boxed up ready to go. So my winner is actually going to be Kayla Plagman. You are the winner of my soundbar. Congratulations. I have it boxed up for you. I'm going to ship it out um, probably Monday. I I don't work on Monday, so I'll ship it out Monday to you. It's going to be great. I hope you enjoy it. I hope you watch all the videos of the reviews that I made of it because um, it's, it's a pretty impressive soundbar nonetheless. So congratulations. Enjoy that. Uh, I do apologize again for um, the first commenter. I couldn't find you on my subscribers list. I don't know if you're not a subscriber or if you just have it hidden for us YouTubers to see, I'm not sure. Um, so I do apologize, but let me know if you are a subscriber or not. And if you are, I do have a special gift for you that I think you'll like just in case um, you are a subscriber. So um, I appreciate you guys joining into my videos. It's been a really fun start to 2019. I see I'm posting a lot of videos lately, trying to get more content out for you guys to watch. I'm trying to post a little more re regularly. So um, stay tuned for more, guys. Definitely make sure you hit the subscribe button because as I get new things, I always, um, you know, I give things away. So and you never know when we'll give away next. So definitely leave a like, leave a comment, and hit that subscribe button so that you're tuned in for more. Tell me what you guys think about my decision to go from 7.2.4 to 5.2.4. Leave me a comment down below. What's your configuration? Are you at 5.1, 5.2? Are you doing Atmos? Are you at seven? Do you have more than seven speakers on your floor level? Let me know down below in the comments, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Enjoy. Okay, guy out.